All right, connecting the GPS to the VHF radio that's got the NEMA functionality or the DSC. You see there it says, please input position only. So I'm gonna connect it to my Garmin um, chart plotter. I think if we go home, information, and no home, can configure. Comms, serial port NEMA 1830, serial port two, serial port one. Okay, so this has two NEMA outputs. Uh, one is the blue wire and GPS signal from the GPS, so that's the plug to the GPS coming out. Port 1 comes out on, so NEMA plus TX is blue and port 2 is grey. So I can check blue or grey to send the GPS signal. Oh, sorry. Again, another boat camera. I'm just checking, both ports are set to NEMA 1830. NEMA standard, NEMA standard, and I want to basically do this. So this is out of my manual for the GPS, the Garmin GPS, and it's saying the blue from the GPS out goes over to the NEMA 180183 compatible device, i.e. my radio, and that's going to go in. And I know on the wiring for the radio, I've got a Lawrence Link 5. And from the GPS needs to go in on the yellow, so NEMA in plus. Now you're supposed to, because it's balanced, it's supposed to connect plus and minus. So I should be connecting yellow and green into the radio. When I do that, it doesn't actually work. And it's because when I come back to this diagram, if anyone else is having this problem, so it doesn't matter about GPS data or NEMA data coming back from the radio. I haven't got anything connected to the radio. I just want DSC to work. So if the kids ever have to press the distress button um, or and it can send it with uh, any of my comms. So I just want to just, just DSC to work. So And I've got my radio operator so I can get the MMS, MMSI number, all that sort of stuff. So we're only interested in GPS from the radio, uh, from the GPS, the NEMA signal over to the radio and then out to the rescue people or you know monitoring our, our radio so we don't care about NEMA data going back from the radio because there's no use for it so I need to connect a blue port 1 or grey port 2 wire out of my GPS over here to the yellow cable going into my radio and notice how it's got the minus for the so you should have TX out positive and TX out negative so that's combining on the Garmin that black ground and this is what I missed so on my radio, so we're only interested in blue coming in, that's got to go to the yellow cable, so it's receiving NEMA GPS signal into my radio, which is great. But I was still getting, please input position, no data. And that was because I didn't do this little thing here. So NEMA TX plus is the blue wire, NEMA TX minus is not used. It's actually grounded on the GPS over here. So it's supposed to be balanced, it's supposed to be two wires, a plus and a minus going over, balanced to reduce noise interference, but they're not doing it like that. So when I come over here, yes, I've got blue to yellow, so I've got the positive going in, but there's no ground part, there's no signal part between here. So what I had to do was find the NEMA in, um, receive minus, which is a green wire, and I had to tie it to the black wire which is the earth. So basically I've done that, that NEMA ground to minus. So on the back of my radio, that is a black wire. And then there's also a green wire, which is over here, green NEMA in minus from GPS. So if I just draw that for you, maybe on here, while I'm holding my phone. So we have the blue is transmit positive. Now it's balanced, so it needs to be two wires. And they do that because if there's noise, it gets cancelled out. When you add that and that together, by the time you get, when it comes over here, it subtracts those, so you get no noise over here. However, because it's short run, they probably don't need it. So I've got blue coming out of here. It needs to go to 
yellow, which is receive plus. So transmit plus from the GPS to receive plus of the, the thing. There is no TX minus. So we also need, because of the thing, we need a TX minus. We need this guy. That is just connected to battery negative over when you do your power wire on when your GPS. Over here, we also have a green wire, which is our receive, NEMA receive minus. So it's over here. So on the radio side, our POS positive is yellow and our minus is green. Sorry, minus is green. And over here on the GPS side, it is blue and black. So, it wasn't working. So I definitely had NEMA data coming out. I used my little multimeter. I could see the, the board rate flickering along. It's supposed to be, I think it's 4,800 board, but I was getting like 1.4 kilos. But I could see there was a, a signal coming here. Um, so it must have been the, this, 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 the negative part. Now, I'd missed that part where you need to tie NEMA ground to the battery ground. So, simple fix out of my radio is out of my accessory cable. So this is just a cable sticking out the back, black, which was battery negative. It's a small wire. All I had to do was join those two. So if I look up here, plus minus really bad battery, that also then, because the black wire, was connected to the earth. So if I do that now, so if I just, thankfully didn't have to pull the whole dash apart. So I've done the, so there's a blue, so that's port one of my NEMA output, GPS signal output. And there'll be a dodgy little wire here. So if I put blue to blue, and I'll just put you down while I do that. I'm just doing this temporarily until I put a plug on it, just to make sure it works. Let's just twist those bad boys together. All right, so now we should have a full connection. Go back, back, charts, navigation, 27111, and now our radio should say 27154. Perfect. So just to wrap that up, if you can't get your GPS talking to your radio, so you get the on your thing, find NEMA plus and minus out of your GPS. One will, it's they're pretty standard color, so one will be blue and the other one should be black. And then out of your radio, you need to find NEMA in receive plus and NEMA in receive minus. Uh, for me to work, I had to just connect blue from the GPS to yellow on the radio auxiliary cable that's hanging out the back. And then I just had to tie the green, which is the NEMA receive minus cable, which is supposed to be the balancing of this cable between them, but they don't worry. The green receive minus, uh, receive, NEMA receive minus, connect that to the black, and the black is connected through your radio to the battery. And now it works.